All right, Candy, Wednesday night. What do we got going on? We got a lot of stuff. Things are moving along pretty well. I want to show somebody one of the aspects of the giant chocolate wall right here. And and really get get a look at how awesome that is going all the way down. Look at all the work that went into that. See the shine? Isn't that great? So we've got two coats of the uh, of the clear coat up on that. It's just magical look. This is magical. Look at that. It's awesome. Um, we do have our handicap bar, ADA required bar here. I only require one of them on my bars. It looks really nice. It's all pretty. Uh, what do we got going on? We start to start to put everything in storage. We're adding more lights up into the ceiling just so I can highlight everything. That's great. What else we got going on? We got our video wall in, right? Started to come in. So here's one of the Samsung TVs. This is going to create a two by two video wall. It's going to get mounted up between the columns right here. We're going to take, they're uh, over here building it right now. We're going to take the mahogany, carry it straight up to the ceiling. And it's going to be a narrow band about 18 inches wide in which the, the back mount is going to mount onto. So it's going to be clean and classy. I didn't want to build a video wall that was too big or too cumbersome simply because when you're sitting up here on the raised area or you're walking along, I don't want people to, I don't want to block this. I want the energy of the of the, of the, of the uh, kitchen. I want the energy of the people on the other side. I still want all to be able to look at all that stuff. If I would have done the video wall bigger, it would have just, it would have blocked that whole wall, literally made it just a wall. Cut out the great energy I got coming back from the kitchen area over there. Um, what else did I want? Oh, also, I want to make sure these TVs are mounted high enough up so when you're sitting down, once our benches get in, when you're sitting down, if someone walks by, I want to make sure that this is the person walking by, that the TV is over so it's not going to be blocking their view. So this TV will move higher up here, the bottom TV, so nobody, no matter what, who's sitting here, nobody can block the view for them if they're just passing by. You know, nobody wants to get all upset about that. DJ booth over here. We got a nice day. It's got the red top on it to match the bars. All walnut. Everything's looking really nice. Walnut and mahogany. Sorry about that. Virgil's over here. Say what's up, Virgil. Hey. Uh, what else we got? We got. Uh, oh, oh, Virgil's making sample tops. Where's it at? It's right over here somewhere. We've got our sample top. So here's our first sample mahogany top. Uh, so we got it all put together. We actually built it and. If you touch the uh, the stone over here, freezing cold, you touch the wood, ooh, nice and warm, cold, warm, cold, warm, nice, I like that, I like to feel the wood, we're gonna, we're, we are going to stain this and then we're going to seal it so it'll have a nice warm, should be uh, matching to the, uh, see, that's what it's supposed to look like, that's what it will look like, everything's coming along good, I got a lot of stuff done today. Here we are, boy, it's late. Uh, still, what is today? Wednesday, still Wednesday. Uh, throwing some stain up there. These are the columns. We built these little towers to mount the plasma wall on. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take it up. There's gonna be one, two, three, four plasmas to make one big giant screen. You see what I did is I created almost like a stealth mount and I tied it in. I built, uh, built it out of mahogany, stained it, and he's about to seal it. And we're going to be able to uh, wire the TVs up there really nice. It's going to go with all the decor. Also, we've got, look at that, handmade. Well, is there any other way to do it? Well, machine and handmade. There you go. So this is what our tables are going to be like. There's what we had right here. This is what was existing, too cold. And this is the final product. Is that beautiful? See how it goes with everything in here? Goes with all the uh, the other mahogany, and this is all also secured down to the bottom. It's a piece of uh, plywood on the bottom with the mahogany on top, and then we've got the stain on there, and then we put a, the uh, clear lacquer coat on top of it. It just goes so much better. That is nice. All right. Hey, so I, I should have sprayed a little bit. No, it was just to bring for people to eat. That's all. Got so. Donna for a to tell. What a pain in the butt was it? A big one. Did you should have seen all the candy drop on my floor and my dog was just licking it all up. I was like, thanks. <laughs> Did you, uh, have you tried one? No. I made those and I brought them over. I haven't tried any of them. So is this like Snow White? I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> <laughs> so let's see what she's got. Tell us which ones you, what do you make? Oh, uh, this one is peanut butter and chocolate and honey graham and I, I muddle them all together 
And then this one's graham crackers. And then this one is both of those together. Uh, this is coconut and almond. Of course, Reese's peanut butter. And then this is uh, pecan and mini chocolate chip portions. And noodles. Oh, yeah, fried noodles. That was just for the staff. <laughs> okay. I'm too hungry, so I bring some. <laughs>